But this should be obvious for a Christian. Now look at the amount of science that supports children getting gender affirming care, as they call it. The science is almost unanimous that this is something that is good for children. Now, does a Christian accept that? Does a, would a Muslim accept that? Would like anyone really who knows children uh, accept that? Uh, no, but that's what the science says. That's what the science says. And that those papers are being used uh, constantly by uh, the far left uh, and progressives to say, look, the our opposition, the Christians who oppose us, the conservatives that oppose us, they are anti-science. They don't understand science. This is something that a Christian cannot deny. And Mike Jones didn't deny it. He just tried to ignore this point. <laughs> he tried to ignore it. And No, I address this, Daniel. Okay. Okay. What, he's, he's comparing apples to oranges. And here, here's an article showing it's, there's a lot of professional disagreement. <laughs> Here's another article that shows there's a lot of professional disagreement. Here's an, a study that was published. I found this really easily, just trying to search uh, a Google Scholar for gender transitioning and mental health. And what they say, if you look down here, overall, there was no significant effects on social transition or name change on mental health status. So how did this study get published?